What up? Happy Sunday to you. Turn that bye -bye. Okay. I do not own the rights to this music or any other music you hear. Whoa, there they are. Hi, how are you today? Welcome. What up, what up, what up? I think I'm finna bundle up because it look kind of chilly out here. What up, what up, what up? Finna check out this little house. They say it's condemned, but uh, I don't know. We about to see what's going on. What up, Chris? That's how the neighborhood look. You would think it's okay, but uh, we'll see in a minute. Eating. You eating again, Josh? All you do is eat. Uh, it's an expensive car coming down the street. Do that mean something? Is that a sign? Am I going to be riding clean like this one day? Oh, it looks like somebody is somebody good. Rolling through, her, rolling through the hood like that. Here. Uh, unless he coming to see this house too. It look like he is. The roof look good on it. Let's see how the side of it look. Huh? Yeah, I know. I talked to him. Huh? Is it is it gonna be knocked down or what? Yeah, they gonna be knocked down. Oh, okay. They, they take it down and then it's gonna be You said they gonna take it? If we keep running too close, we'll take it. Wow. Because the car, you don't leave it just sitting there and being watched. Oh, wow. Yep, so we're trying to buy it, so I'm gonna see what it looks like. The city of Normandy? Yep. Okay. Okay. Perfect. Okay, thank you. Yeah, we want to make it look good like the rest of these houses. Come over and see what this dude talking about. He got to be neighborly with me. Uh-oh, but the pit bull don't get me. Uh-oh, he almost got you. I, I don't know if I need to get too close to him. <laughs> I know, he ready to come out and get, he, he heard lunch outside, he said he finna come get me. Tell him I don't want to be lunch today. Dang, but it like it been some fire damage or something here. Yeah, I work with Sean. Oh, yeah. How you doing? Dang, they come out spilling the beans. Like, damn. They told me the whole story. That nice backyard. I guess. Some kind of a backyard. Should I go talk to them some more? They telling everything. Oh, this thing all boarded up back here. He like, yeah, the roof don't look bad. That's the best thing on this mud. Nice roof. Is this on a slab? I don't see a basement. They got an old raggedy AC on their thing. I don't see one on this house, though. <laughs> Say the doggy gonna get me. <laughs> don't let that big dog come out. Whatever you do, I got something for him. And I don't miss. <laughs> oh, that dude must work for the city. He over there giving him the business. He over there yelling at him like, man, y'all need to clean up this front yard. Because let's see, they got all this stuff, all this trash out here and stuff in front of their house. All kind of stuff. He over there telling about me too, dang. Everybody, I'm going to go over there and talk to him in a second. As long as they put that dog away, I'm going to let him have it. He run out on me. I got 11 shots. And all of them going to connect to the head. Head shots. I guess it don't look that bad on the outside. 
But this dude must work for the city or something. This is the dude riding behind that nice, clean car. Let's see what he's talking about again. He's yelling. They better get that guy. I'm finna see what he's saying. Y'all don't say nothing. Be quiet. So that's what we're trying to keep you from, from getting into court and getting into trouble. You work for the city. I am the mayor. Oh, the mayor. The council member. Oh, how y'all doing? I'm Chris. How you doing? Good. I'm trying so to help thank you. bring the neighborhood it. back a little bit. I appreciate good, good. How you doing? I seen you somewhere. You look familiar. Uh, Lindbergh High School? No, I don't know. Oh, I see you. Uh, around the area, skating? Probably. Oh, right. Maybe something with yeah. the community or something. I'm the, uh, the chess. I'm the chess. The chess master. Okay. Yeah, I do all that and tennis and even park and all over, you know. Oh, you be everywhere, but huh? the third ward. That's my ward over there. I'm the uh, city council over there. Oh, okay. So if you drive through, you might see my signs and this and I can see this the mayor. Oh, all right. The mayor. Say, I came out patrolling on them say, get well, this stuff straight. We campaigning for young ladies uh, running in this ward. You know? Oh, okay. So, you, you live here? No, I live in South County. Okay, so yeah, we just campaign and you know, when the mayor sees something, when we see something, we just kind of speak on it. Yeah, because I mean, you got to keep this stuff Better straight. Better we talk to him than give him a ticket. Yeah, I mean, that's the right way to do it anyway. At least I can't say I didn't know or... You know he ain't had to that bar. Yeah, they already know that's the rule. All they got to do is... They already know that. So, you know, he's been there for two or three weeks. Oh, wow. So, I mean, how's that? Look at the one over there. See the one on that backyard on the side? Mm, they're everywhere. No, but I'm just on the side. Mm. Uh, it's supposed to be on the side, not on the front. Side, side yeah. or back, but not the front. But really, not even on the side. Mm. But at least it's behind the fence. Okay. Boom! This is right up front. Mm. Okay. All right, Chris. All right, see you, y'all. Be safe out here. Ron clean now. I need to get me one of them one day. Yeah, this, this is the owner of the property. Oh, okay. And so, like what we were saying, in fact, um, as I told him, I said, we can't let it sit here for another year. It's already been here almost almost a year and a half now or more like this. If not, then what we do, we'll be forced to ticket him and say, you, you know, we don't care if the inside is smoked up from the fire, burnt. So this is what you call a gut rehab. Right, okay, that's what they told me. Yeah. It's a gut rehab. There ain't no saving. The, even the timbers in the, in the ceiling in the basement have to be wow. replaced. So it's real fire damage. Yep. Okay, yeah, perfect. It's bad. Oh, okay, it's pretty bad. Yeah. I was just getting ready to go inside, so it ain't really nothing to see if it's that bad, huh? Well, I mean, you can go in there. Okay, yeah, I, I got the key. I was, I was getting ready to go in. Either? Yeah, I got it. I was okay. just getting ready to go in. I was just checking out the outside. I said the outside looked good, but. I can't remember her name that I was spoken with to do the contract stuff with. Yeah. All right, I'll just take a quick look at it and get out of here. I was just coming to check a look at it before it got dark outside. We got an extra daylight. You just so. planning on work, or? No, I was, we were gonna, we were looking to buy it, but I mean, I don't know if it's that bad. I mean, we'll see. I mean, it depends okay. on the situation. But they just, I just coming to take a look at it real quick. All right, thanks. Yeah. The mayor got on his head. He said, y'all better get this dang old barbecue grill up out of here, boy. Get that barbecue grill up out of here. But yeah, this house fire damage. I didn't, I knew it was, needed some work, but I didn't know it was fire damage like that. It looked like it is, though, with that front part right there. I'm just going to look in the front door. I ain't going to look at too much of it. Let's see here. So let's look like that. Let's see. Danger. Keep out. Let's see what we do here. Does this key work? Knock, knock. Real estate. Oh, yeah. They already good at it. Okay. That ain't bad. Knock, knock. Hope nobody's home. Damn, somebody been here doing some serious work. Can you do something with this house? You need everything. Drywall, electrical. Is electrical bad? Might as well. You got a disc broke down. Might as well do everything over, right? Look like that used to be a bedroom. At least they started working on it. That's the plus. Because sometimes you come in these, it's like pure charred, messed up. You don't see nothing. It's a small little house, though. You like these kind of houses? That dude was like, oh, man, how'd you know where the key was? Because I'm connected, bro. I'm Chris Monroe. He didn't know who he was talking to, did he? How'd you know how to get in? Because that's what I do. It's kind of dark, man. That's all you can see in this house. I don't think I'm going too much farther, but we see it needs everything. Just wanted to get an idea. It tells you a lot just walking in the front door. Anything else I need to see in here? Should I go any deeper?
I knew it needed work, but I didn't know they meant like everything, everything. You say three care, do I do two thousand? Two thousand, I'm gonna go three. Wanna go three now? Four, wanna go five and now six? Come on back and go six. We got six, wanna go bid with six. Six, 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 wanna go seven, wanna go seven, wanna go seven thousand. I got seven thousand. Anybody wanna go eight thousand on this house right here? Eight thousand, eight thousand, eight thousand. Come on, eight thousand now, nine thousand. Nine thousand, gotta get them around, gotta get them around. Wanna go, wanna go, wanna go. You yeah, bought it, eight thousand. No, I don't know, they want more than that for this house. But we'll see in a minute. Y'all silly. <laughs> All right, I guess I'm getting up out of here and doing some more woke stuff because uh, this house has had it, and that's why it's condemned because it needs every dang thing. Hurry thing. Let's lock it up. Why don't I just put a little on it? It's secure, and we're done. But that dude got yelled at big time for having all that barbecue grill and stuff in the front. Dumpster permit. Where the dumpster at? Oh, they must have had a dumpster right here originally. Look like y'all already started on it, so that's a good thing. Because sometimes I go in them and they haven't done anything yet. Is it a basement here? Oh, I guess it is, huh? Because it is a uh, drive-in garage. You said they had two big dumpsters and stuff out? Yeah, two. I mean, it was just cold. Wow. Because they had all their shit in there, too. I was going to say, well, at least they cleaned it all out, so that's a plus. I mean, you know, it could always be worse. Right. Because some, sometimes I go in them and you can see all the black and you got to get all that and it just, yeah. I didn't know the whole thing burnt up. I knew it needed work, but I didn't know it was a full. Well, the fire was in the basement, but, you know, they got the top too because, you know, smoke, it destroys everything. Oh, so the, ba the basement was where the fire really was. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, that's how the game goes. So, yeah, I'll, uh. I'll see what uh what we can do. What's it? What, what you think is worth when it's fixed back up? They just did that one. They ain't going. Oh, that one over there. Yep, they got it listed right now. I think it's at ninety thousand dollars. That's Colton. Yeah. Yeah, I think I saw that one online. That was listed for like 90, eighty. It's 89, eighty. Eighty nine nine or some shit. Yeah, and it been sitting for two months. Yeah, they ain't gonna can't get, go off they of that ain't get that. I think realistically. They're going to probably end up sitting on that for another six months until it gets down to $60,000-ish. Because they bought it for twenty. I mean, what did they put in it? I mean, a lot have, of them. I have no idea. I saw they bought it for twenty, and I'm like, you bought it for twenty. you put a little bit in it, don't put too much. They did a good job. I saw the pictures, but 80000 I mean, the marketplace is telling us the truth. If it's, say, 80000 that's been on for 55 days, it's probably too high, it's you too know? High. <laughs> the marketplace keep us all in check no matter what. So you think it's worth about maybe sixty or something like that? If it was done up ready to go max max, max 60. 60 65 so just say 55 and we're gonna pray for 60 yeah <laughs> and so to do the little bit of work left i mean that, that did a lot of it's been done i was just about to uh see what date we did that contract on or whatever or the sign the thing yeah okay all right, I'll, I'll see you. I'll, uh, I'll get this off my shoulder. I know that's right. It, it, it's, it's a pain point, especially when the uh, mayor and them roll around. Yeah, I was looking like, where they roll? The mayor pissed off at me, apparently. So uh, the mayor gonna get you. You better yeah. get. You better get that barbecue grill out the front. <laughs> the mayor. Forty to fifty, maybe. Yeah, that house. That house across the street, right there. That's the house that's listed right now for seventy nine nine. They redid it all. I looked it up. And uh, it's 79.9, and they were actually, uh, it's been on the market for 55 days. That's a long time. The marketplace will keep you straight. So what do you think about that house? Is that a go or a no-go? Look like it need everything. And when a house need everything, I need it for real cheap, like, I don't know, three grand. So low where I can't mess up. I want it so cheap, as close to zero as you can get. That's the number one answer. <laughs> For those who don't know, my name is Chris Monroe, the student master teacher, Mr. I Stay Woke. Talking about this real estate. Just walk through this house real quick to make sure that it's something worth messing with. Is that the mayor coming back again? They serious. They worse than the police. They, they swooping the uh, neighborhood like ain't nothing wrong. Look at them. He riding around. He getting it. He riding around. He getting it. His car so clean. He don't know what to do with himself. He riding through here like he own the place. The mayor and the councilman or something. So I guess they got their thing. Riding clean. I said, I knew it was somebody. 
You say $1,000 and go, Stephanie? Sounds about right. Dirt cheap, Landers. You right, bro. Dirt cheap. Dirt, dirt cheap, cheap. How much of repairs did they get? Uh, I don't know. Looked like a lot because he said the fire started in the basement and then they gutted the whole top. So, I mean, the house isn't that big. It's not a, I mean, it can be saved. It's just that, you know, you're going to have to spend that money. And that house sitting across the street for 80000 is it in my rear view? Look at that. It's in the background almost. If I move over. You can see the house that's listed for seventy nine nine, which I already knew that was too high when I saw that. So, uh, I don't know. I need to get that house like under 10. Under 10 and you might just win. Mayor running down on folk. Exactly. That's how we do it in St. Louis. And it's a little municipality. We got about 91 or 92 of them around here. And they all do what they want to do. They got their own police departments, their own fire department. Well, not really fire department. Some of them got their own police departments, their own everything, doing their own stuff. 25 to 30 can rehab. So if you buy for 10, you put about 30 in rehab, that's 40. Then you think about holding costs and stuff, you're talking about 50. Any money left? And dude right here was probably close when he said it's probably worth 60. You want to put all that out to make 10 grand? I'd rather do a little quick wholesale deal to make 10 grand. I don't have to do no work. But that's just my take. So I'm going to get up out of here and do some more woke stuff. Make sure you follow me on all social media outlets at Chris Monroe STL. That's Snapchat, that's Twitter, that's Instagram, that's Facebook, and all of them at Chris Monroe STL. And don't forget, if you like real estate and stuff like this, join the new Woke Real Estate Investing Group. Search it right here on Facebook, or I can put it in the description or something when I get done, maybe. Maybe. Or hit me up, you know. Join the new Woke Facebook Investing Group, and we'll uh, do like that. You say 15, I don't know. You might make 15, but you can make 15 on a wholesale deal. Why would you do all that work to make 10 or 15 grand? I don't want to work for it. I want to just get it. I'm being honest. See, people be lying out here. Somebody, they want to work. I'm like, I don't want to work. I just want to collect checks. I'm just going to keep it real with you. Do you want to collect checks or do you want to work? You want to collect checks or do you want to work? Work or checks? I'm for the check team, baby. So I'm about to get up out of here, y'all. Do some more woke stuff. Do what you do. Be who you be. And I'll see you before you see me.